Alright, welcome back to Tarrant Plays FTL. In our last episode, if we continue, we had uh, five good crew members, including a pretty good boarding party, uh, although not really enough energy. I think it's probably a good thing for us to upgrade our power here. Uh, that still gives us the ability to buy some fuel if we need. And we're about to jump to Sector 3. We've got Zoltan and Uncharted. Uh, the Zoltans can be really annoying because of the Zoltan shield, uh, but they're also nicer. Uh, so let's give it a try and see Sector 3, see what goes on. All right, we start with a distress call. This is a pretty nice sector because we've got three nebula zones up here that will delay the rebels, and then we can go straight down. So let's start with the distress beacon uh, and see what we got. Oh, single life form. So we generally, we're either going to lose a crew member or gain a crew member. I say we go. A lone survivor. Let's invite him. All right. Excellent. All right, Charlie, you are our new shield guy, while Rocky, or Fleishy, which is just such a real name I think of when I think Rock, uh, uh, can be our boarding crew. Uh, all right, we got a store down there, so we're going to wrap around this way, see if we can pick up a little bit of scrap more before heading to that store. Yes, we'll be happy to do this. All right, so we'll do that before we get to the exit. We need to buy some fuel here. If you have drones, the drone recovery arm is just fabulous, but really, we just want to Let's buy you out. There we go. We're uh, now pretty safe for a while. So we can go through here, down, and to our quest marker. I really like going through those nebula. Okay. Oh, drones. That's no good. Oh, but it's a beam drone, so okay. No, actually, do not fire that. Uh, Even though they've got a bomb and everything, we're just going to do this all at once. Looks like they Alright. Uh, we've got their uh, weapons damaged. Rocky, come in here and help with the fixing of, uh, of this. Uh, that was quite a lot of damage to our weapons. Really unfortunate. Their repair drone, repair bot, is uh, working on getting the weapons fixed again. Uh, Alright, so our hull laser can come back up. You guys move back because you guys are uh, look like you are going to be invading here. Alright, the weapons are all back, so... As soon as the hull laser is back up, or not, because... Uh, all right, darn it. I was hoping we would be able to, uh... To get things damaged. Uh... Sure, why not? I never like to board if they've got a, a med bay, so let's just accept this and move onward. Let's get everybody fixing. Really was excited about being able to try out that, uh, that teleporter, but uh, hey, if there's uh, if it's just not available, it's just not available. Fix the doors.
Bovi. Oh, another distress call. Sure, why not? Let's see what happens. Need some fuel. Ah. Uh, sorry. That's the one. Like anything but fuel. Ah. Uh. Uh, okay, they've got a. Uh, The thing is, I can't really board this because uh, they these things never have any air because they are scouts, so the crew that you send over may be able to destroy something, but they will also immediately die. So, we're just going to do that. Uh, I think that was fairly successful. But again, I want to wait for everything to be... Uh, be charged before we get to fire. Oh, we breached a room that has no air in it. Nicely done. Oh, our oxygen is on fire. Uh, okay. Yeah. Good to know. Get out of there. Let's uh, open all these doors and make sure that uh... Okay. So we are safe here. A lot of scrap. That's nice. And our oxygen is destroyed. Well, in any case, that'll help put out the fire. But that will make the uh, process of fixing the oxygen just that much more annoying because there's going to be no uh, there's going to be no uh, oxygen in that room. But with two of them working together. Get you off to sick bay. Heal you up. All right, everybody, and let's say no ion storms. Fleishy is ready to go, and we'll jump while he is. Uh, Right. Here we are, another, yet another scout, and ooh, that's quite a, uh, quite a weapon there. Uh, okay, we really want to uh, make sure this weapon doesn't get to fire if at all possible, so we're going to take all of these out. Yes, looks like only one of those hit, but it was enough. If this guy wants to keep firing his one laser, uh, I don't think we're going to really get in his way. Alex! Come on! What am I paying you for? You weren't even one of those freed slaves. It's going to take a very long time to kill this thing. Maybe I'll bring up that Artemis uh, launcher. No. I see you, jump marker, that you are ready, and we are not going to give in here. Okay. With those down, let's take out the... Uh, let's gonna take out the piloting here. Uh, and now we'll be No longer have any evade, so it's just up to Alex to see whether he hits. Alright, Alex, you just gained a level in guns, or lasers, or whatever. Nice. Well done. Jolly good. Ion beam and a uh, and one of my triple lasers. That's uh, that's a little uh, risky. Ow! Take this. Uh, 
Ah, oh, they got our uh, oxygen here. Oh. Well, Rocky, you can go in there because you're not affected by fire. Alright, all of our lasers are back. All of the weapons are down. He is ready to go. Rocky, fix that up, please. And, uh... I'd love to board you. I'll accept that. Love to be able to board that ship, but it's just not in the cards. All right, onward to our quest. Ah, uh, this is never good. Uh, you either uh, you either get boarded or uh, good things happen. Let's see what happens. Okay, like I said, you either get boarded or bad things happen. Uh, but it's a Zoltan and a Slug, and they've got two Zoltans on there. Okay, uh, this is uh, this is like meat. Uh, come on, Shield, come back. As long as you're back before the beam goes. Darn it. Uh, Alex, I'm really, really, really disappointed in you. Okay. Uh. Shield up, shield up, shield up. Oh, it's a halberd, it's a halberd beam that will penetrate the shields. Okay, uh, we need both of these to fire. Uh. Okay, everything is down. All right. Guys. Two Zoltan cannot possibly... Oh, they've got a... Uh... Okay, that'll do. All right, 36 scrap. You get so much... Oh, nice. Uh, you get so much more... Uh, so much more uh, scrap and the like when you... Uh, when you board... Uh, as long as you make sure that you actually are back before the ship explodes. But most of the time I find I more than make up for the cost of the crew teleporter. Although that one uh, was pretty costly. And I think it may be time to look at a shield upgrade. We also... Uh, looking here, have a huge number of missiles. Uh, but it would cost 75 to upgrade that. I think it would be will be worth uh, upgrading our weapon one notch just to bring the Artemis missile back and use some of those. Uh, Everybody's healed. And what is our quest? All right, so we've got uh, the Mantis encampment. Uh, send a long-range message. Uh, let's see, we've got bombard their key structures with a missile weapon. All right, well, we certainly have that. Uh, Ah, cost a missile to do absolutely nothing. Okay, now this this ship is neat. If he tries to board, uh, okay, that mantis is dead. He'll probably die before they get a chance to come back. Okay. 
two shields now, and indeed they do. Okay, we are going to... Uh, rather than bother with, because uh, he's going to keep... Uh, Good thing they didn't uh, fire over here and try to kill Urza. I think we can probably damage him faster than he can damage us. Uh, if we've got two of us, but... Please don't kill Urza. Oh, he missed. Excellent! Uh, look at that. Bring him home! Get everybody healed up, and let's repair. Really need to start uh, and uh, bring that oxygen back up. All laser. And boarding party. So we really need to find a shop to let ourselves repair. It would really suck to have this nice uh, setup we have here and have it destroyed thanks to uh, having uh, no access to a shop. Well, our only location to go to right now is the exit. And we'll move forward. We're going to be a hero. Uh, oh, I forgot to repair the doors. Uh, well, they don't have a boarding party, so... Uh, and in fact, I mean, take a look at this, this ship. It has no med bay. It's got a Zoltan and a Slug. Uh, this is absolute uh, meat for our uh, boarders. Uh, and uh, we may get... Uh, Miss missile. There's supposed to be a missile, not a hit. Uh, darn it! All right, we are desperately. We're going to uh, head you over here. Oh, I can't open the doors. Uh, okay. That's what happens when you forget to, uh... Oh my goodness, and if that thing, uh... does too much damage, it will cause a, uh, hull damage. So, please open the door. F fix the doors, fix the doors, fix the doors. Uh... Go out, go out, go out. We do not want this ship to die. We do not want this ship to die. No, good ship. As Commander Riker said, the lollipop. It's a good ship. Siggy. useful if we actually put the power into the med bay. <clears throat> wow. Okay, Tarrant. Uh, no more fighting. Let's, uh... And in fact, uh, let's, uh, pretty much forget about the rest of this sector and just try to move on to the next. Any uh, missile that we find from a, in the next uh, sector before we can repair is going to destroy us. Oh, a store! Now this is fascinating. Uh, the rebels will be on top of me, but I can go and I think I'm going to risk it because uh, I mean, better alive now than, you know, dead later. So... 58, dun, 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 dun. we are fixed, and while we're at it, all right, you see, 
that was, uh, that was good. And yes, this is not good, but, uh, what can we do? Uh, Whatever happens here, we're going to be in better situation than we were had we not uh, done that. So, uh... oh, and that uh, that uh, missile missed. So that was that was convenient. Uh, that was really nice. Ah, uh... uh, he warped back. And it was the missile launcher that went away. That was convenient. Uh, now, normally, I would definitely try to board this ship, but with uh, given that it has a med bay and they are at times very annoying to uh, try and fix. But all we're doing is waiting for charging. We're not going to. Everything on their end is fixed. We're gonna get probably one missile coming our way. Oh! Oh, look at that. We set them on fire. All right. Next Hector. Let's get out of here. We've got more Zoltan or Slug. Uh, yeah, but I don't like them. Let's go to the... Uh, Let's go to the Sultan, even though I'd kind of like to get that slug ship that I don't have unlocked. Uh, all right, so we managed to leave that uh, Federation, uh, or that, uh, you know, that encounter, that rebel encounter, with full, uh, full health and uh, everything intact. So I consider that a win. Uh, all right, we've got this guy here to allow us a little more exploration time. Uh, but we can't get there without going across, so let's, uh, and if we get down here, though, we, uh, so we'll go from here, 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 uh, and let's, uh, but let's move up. Oh, look, they've got a teleporter. Oh, they're teleporting to our teleporter. I have no idea what missile that is, but I do not want to fight it. Ah, oh, they've got a missile on. Ow. I feel like I could feel that from here. Ah! Oh. It warped back. Almost killed him. Shut all the doors. I think maybe time to upgrade the doors. I'll get their fireproofing. I also want to get this missile going. Four fuel, two drones, 22 scrap. I think that's need some sort of mod that ups the speed of the rock. I know that's their their downside, but man, it's annoying. Or at least perhaps upgrades the speed of the rock crew member when you're not in danger. Uh, no fires, no nothing. All right, moving on. Ah. Uh, 
don't need drones, so let's move on. A store. Uh, hmm. I don't think there's anything that that store can offer that I would want. So let's uh, let's bypass it and see what else is around. Fuel for missiles? I certainly don't need that. Uh, into the nebula. As long as we don't have uh... ah. Come on, people! You're using up all my fuel for nothing. Like they're toying with me. I want to fight. Two missiles for two drone parts. Well, drone parts sell for more, so if anything else, it's uh, I'll do that. Well, these guys have an incredible weaponry, but what I see best of all is they have uh, no. Med Bay, and so our goal is going to be to take out, get one shot in at uh, this guy here, and uh, once they have uh, done a little work there, No, we're not going to accept surrender. Instead, we are going to send our people over and kill you. Amazing. S six fuel, 43 scrap. Ah! What uh, lovely days. Fix the med bay, and if you fix the med bay, I will let you get healed in it. While we're at it, uh, let's get this missile launcher back up. I think it would be useful to have a... Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Uh... Let's get one more. Let's get this guy and this guy. Next thing, next time we get a chance, we will also do the doors. This also gives a little protection in case the weaponry is damaged that we keep the hull laser and the burst laser. Uh, mm, let's try this. All right, power up the med bay. Both Tarrant and Siggy got... Uh, got an upgrade to their uh, uh, to their level which gives us a little bit extra evade uh, that's good and I think we'll just uh, do that uh, while we're here okay uh, let's see what we got that really helps us on the fuel front and it seems clear maybe I need a uh, Maybe I need a drone control, not because I actually want one, but because, hey, uh, I mean, 18 drones, that's enough to last you pretty much all the game. Oh, fire as well, the rock people will do that. Long range scanners and 44 scrap. Well, I promised I would upgrade the doors, so we're going to upgrade the doors. Possible ship detected. Possible ship detected. And I think we'll be able to get uh, all the way if I go here, here, exit. Because the rebels will be here, here, just barely. I think we'll be okay. So let's start. Let's try to get it, take out some ships, get us some extra scrap. Alright, what do we got here? We have an attack drone, uh, and uh, two repair drones. Uh, so we're going to try to take out uh, their drone control. Alright, now that that's done, our, you know what, I really should have gone for the shield. 
quite sure why I didn't do that. Uh, okay. Missile, you are going to go for the shield. Is what I should have done first. Nice going. Ah! Can't hit the broad side of a barn! Engine's completely down. Uh. Ah! Help fix the engines. We're not charging. Alright. Uh, again. Take out that. Alright. I lost a shield bump. That, uh, looks like it took out the, uh... Lost the oxygen. Head in there, guys. Their shields are fixed again. Oh. Yes! At this point, I barely even care what their offer is. Uh. I have no idea why they decided that they were in as much danger as they thought they were, but I ain't, I ain't complaining. We at least had the missile, although, uh, it did miss quite a bit. Alex, you're slacking. Door's fixed. Everybody happy. And, well, maybe this ship will be in, will be better. We're only in second four. Uh... pick up a Zoltan life raft. Uh, I'm certain it is clear that you must not destroy my vessel in the process. Well, come on, dude. Uh, you know, what do you want? Uh, well, all they have is a slug and a human and no midday, so uh, it is absolutely positive that we could manage to do this without... Uh, But, in order to teleport in, we must get through the Zoltan shield, so... Really? He's got one of those 5-0 lasery things? Uh... Okay, and the 5 -oh lasery thing is almost... Why does he have no oxygen? Oh, that's because I shut off the oxygen. Yeah, it's those minor details. Uh, okay, let's send our borders because we doesn't want us to destroy his ship in the process. Got it. Uh, 43 scrap and a weapon pre-igniter. Oh. Joy of joys. Oh. Alright, the weapon pre-igniter means that we do not have to wait for the weapons to charge after jumping. Uh, there are few things more wonderful. Uh, 
Right. All right. And our prediction was correct. We now can head to the exit. So we are pretty much finished with Sector 4. We are not going to accept a bribe. Let's attack this pirate. Look at that. A Mantid and a... And a, and a Zoltan. Uh, and we've got all of this uh, ready. They can... Yeah, they couldn't even fire. Uh, I didn't even fire the missile. Let's fire the missile just for fun. Yeah. This fight is over. Thank you, Zoltan, for coming in and dying rather than us having to go to you. All right, fuel, drone parts, scrap. Ah. No, I see, this is another thing. I'd love to have them delay the pursuing fleet, but uh, there's no, uh, you know, there just isn't uh, enough time. They're right behind me. So, bye-bye. Well, I didn't get to salvage it? Okay, uh, we have a lot of money here. Uh, looks like uh, we can either use this for... Uh, some more power, maybe. Uh, I'm actually a, a, a big fan of upgrading uh, of upgrading engines. Uh, and let's just upgrade the oxygen one unit. The nice thing is that if you upgrade the oxygen and such, it doesn't even matter if you if you power them. Uh, oxygen and med bay. There will be blue. Uh, choices you can make based on that uh, that will become available just by the fact that you've got it even if you don't actually power it and on top of that if you hit one of the events that reduces your oxygen or med bay you'll still have a notch left uh, so let's uh, add another five percent to our evade get our shields going uh, and I think we're ready to go to the next sector. So let's uh, let's make that. Ooh, let's go to the Angies. Very nice. All right. Uh, I think that's a uh, long enough uh, session here. But we're now in sector five with a slightly damaged hull, but a nice crew, and we're uh, we're really getting our scrap collection going. So. Uh, join us next time for Tarrant Plays FTL. Let's see if we can make it all the way to our final sector and destroy the flagship. Have a wonderful snowpocalypse.